हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू सॉर्ट ऑफ क्लासेस वेलकम टू सॉर्ट ऑफ क्लासेस इन आवर टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सम क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम आई एस आई बी स्टैट टू पेपर सो दिस इज अ वेरी रिसेंट पेपर विच वी आर सॉल्विंग टूडे of uh, ISI 2019 थाउजेंड नाइनटीन बी स्टैट वेरी रिसेंट पेपर सो इट्स विल इट विल भी वेरी बेनिफिशियल फॉर ऑल दोज कैंडिडेट्स हुआ एस्पायरिंग फॉर आई एस आई हु आर एस्पायरिंग फॉर द प्रेस्टिजियस इंडियन स्टैटिस्टिकल इंस्टीट्यूट एंड वॉन्ट टू गो इन टू आई एस आई सो दे नीड टू क्रैक द एग्जाम बी स्टैट सो देर आर मेरी डिफिकल्ट क्वेश्चन विद द स्टूडेंट्स कैन नॉट बी एबल टू सॉल्व बाई देर ओन सो हियर आर सॉल्व सज क्लासेज वी आर एडिंग यू सो दैट यू कैन गेट द फुल सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन complete solution even if the question type is uh, even if the question type is mcq but we are giving a full solution step by step explanation has been given to you step by step explanation has been given to you in this video and in our previous videos as well and the concept building is important concept making is done here so lot of things you will be giving uh, you will be getting uh, in this video so isi bsta 2019 video uh, we have uh, we will solving a lot of questions in this video so first question which we are going to solve today in this video is question number 21 which is on your screen right now so question number 21 is for every real number x not equal to 1 let a function fx equal to x by x plus 1 now write f1 of x equal to fx and for all n greater than equal to 2 fn x equal to fn minus 1 x matlab One is one uh, step uh, previous than this. Then f1 minus 2 into f2 minus 2 up to uh, fn minus 2 must equal to what? So we have got four alternatives: 2 to the power n by 1 into 3 into 5 into 2 n minus 1. Second option is 1. Third option is 1 by 2 uh, 2 n c n. And third option is 2 n c n. So these four options we have, and any one of the options is correct. Now we have to find that correct option. So let me write the options over here: two n by one into three into five into two n minus one. Second option is one. Third option is one by two into two n n. And fourth option is two n n. So these four options we have, and out of which any one is correct. So we have to find the correct option. So let's move back to the solution. Let's the sol move to the solution part and find the correct solution of this video. Okay. So for uh, you know for the function which is given to us, function f x equal to x by x plus one. Now f one x is equal to f x in greater than equal to two. It is given. Now. If n x is less is less than equal to f of if n minus one that is one step previous x, so we will do by induction process. Okay, now by induction, mathematical induction you all know I think by induction we will prove that if n minus two is equal to two by 2n minus 1. Now, f2x equal to f of f(x) equal to f of 2 in that is 2 by 3. So this thing we are getting. Now, f3x will be what? F3x can be written as 2 by 3 divided by 2 by 3 plus 1. So it will be equal to two by three by five by three. So three three will cancel out. So it will be two by five. So by induction, by induction, if one x is equal to two by two into one minus one, that is equal to two. So x equal to minus two. x equal to minus two. Now let f n minus one into x is equal to two by two of n minus one minus one. This is uh, given. Let let this be equal to this. Then the this value f n x f of f n minus one x. 
x equal to minus 2 can be written as 2 upon 2n minus 3 by 2 by 2n minus 3 plus 1 which can be written as 2 by 2n minus 3 by 2 plus 2n minus 3 by 2n minus 3 now this 2n minus 3 can be cancelled out so we can write it as 2 by 2 plus 2n minus 3 or we can also write it like 2 by 2n minus 1 or 2 by 2 of n minus 1 we can also write it like this thus afn minus 2 can be written as 2 divided by 2 of n minus 1 so what does it imply thus we can say that f1 minus 2 f2 minus 2 in this way we continue up to fn minus 2 it will be equal to 2 into 2 by 3 into 2 by 5 these values we have got into 2 by 2n minus 1 so that is equal to 2 to the power n by 1 into 3 into 5 into 2n minus 1 which was our one of the options so let's move let's move back to the option part so here i have written the first option is correct so this is the correct option the right option for this question so we have solved question number 21 from isi b stat 2019 paper so i hope you understood this uh, question now we'll be moving towards the next question so the next question is question number 22 now we will be solving question number 22 from the same year same paper that is isi bstat 2019 so uh, now we will be solving this okay so let's uh, discuss the question question number 22 let the integers a i for i lying between 0 and 54 be defined by the equation 1 plus x plus x square whole to the power 27 equal to a naught plus a 1 x plus a 2 x square up to a 54 x to the power 54 then a 0 a 3 a 6 a 9 up to a 54 equal to what so this question is been has been given now there are four alternatives the first is 3 to the power 26 then 3 to the power 27 then 3 to the power 28 and then 3 to the power 29 so four options have been given to us so let's uh, solve this question so 1 plus x plus x square whole to the power 27 has been given it is equal to a naught plus a1 x plus up to a54 x to the power 54 now for x equal to 1 what will happen it will be 3 to the power 27 equal to a naught plus a1 now we are putting x uh, in place of x we are putting 1 okay plus up to a54 let it be equation 1 for x equal to omega it will be 1 plus omega plus omega to the power 27 so a naught plus a1 omega plus a2 omega square plus up to infinity that is part 2 for x equal to omega square we have 1 plus omega square plus omega to the power 27 equal to a0 plus a1 omega square plus a2 omega up to this is 3 now if we add 1 2 3 if we add this thing what we will get we will get 3 to the power 27 equal to 3 comma a naught plus a3 up to this why because 1 plus omega plus omega square is equal to 0 isn't it is equal to 0 so we will get this 3 to the power 27 equal to 3 into a 0 plus a 3 plus uh, this thing 
and now if we take 3 common from here if we take 3 over there it will be 3 to the power 26 equal to a0 plus a3 plus up to a54 so this is what which we, uh, we were demanded so uh, this value we were asked to find out and we have found this value to be 3 to the power 26 the correct option is option number a correct option is option number a that is 3 to the power 26 so 3 to the power 26 is the correct option for this question that is question option number a is the correct option for this question of isibc 2019 paper question number 22 now we will be moving towards our next question so the next question which we will be solving is question number 23 from the same paper isib that 2019 so this question let's read this question and try solving this okay So an examination has 20 questions uh, for each question has 20 questions for each question the marks that can be obtained are either minus 1 0 or 4 now let s be the set of possible total marks that a student can score in the examination okay so s is the uh, set where the total marks of the student which he can score is uh, denoted then the number of element elements in s will be what whether it is 93 or 94 or 95 or 96 four options are there out of which any one is correct so let's solve this question okay so this is going to be a very interesting question as it seems from reading the question now important thing to note is that zero in the question is that of a modulator okay the role of zero is in the modulator that is if there are uh, okay let me write that note that the role of a zero in the question is that of a modulator okay that is uh, if we say that is if uh, if there are uh, a minus ones and b force any combination then minus a plus 4b can be counted as a possible value okay that is if a plus b is less than equal to 20 as the remaining can be attributed to 0 can be attributed to 0 now important thing another important thing to note is that every integer in this question that if uh, the part which is given the marks the every integer that is from minus 20 to 0 the students 20 students are there can be achieved by taking uh, mod of x minus 1s and remaining zeros now for integers now for integers that is x greater than 0 we divide the we divide them into group of force that is consecutive integers okay that is consecutive integers of the form that is 4n minus 3 4n minus 2 4n minus 1 4n in this form a group is formed that is say group is n okay and you can be written as n is 4n minus k okay where k lies belongs to 1 2 in this way 
now any element any any element now any element can be achieved if can be achieved if k plus n less than equal to 20 thus the integers are less than 80 which cannot be found by this method or is, is less than 20 so the integers which are less than 80 cannot be found cannot be found by this method are seventy nine seventy eight seventy seven seventy four seventy three and sixty nine okay so as for these integers k plus n is greater than 20 okay k plus n is greater than 20 so the total number of integer that can be formed are 80 minus of minus 20 plus 1 minus 6 that is equal to 95 the total integers which can be formed is equal to 95 now let's move back to the question part and see that yes we have an option that is 95 so 95 is the correct option or you can say that uh, option c is right so in this video we have solved three questions from isi and b stat 2019 isi b stat 2019 uh, here at soft classes we have done three questions the three questions which we solved are 23 22 and 21 question number 21 22 23 we have solved and i hope that you all understood this video and uh, everything is there in your mind we have uh, uh, given you full solution the complete solution we have given with the step by step explanations we have given to you step by step explanations has been provided and uh, concept building has been done some theoretical parts has also been discussed and uh, we have done three questions in 18 minutes and uh, while explaining it so uh, per question six minutes with explaining and so if you do it without explaining then you can do it within two to three minutes per question so time management has been has also been taken into consideration that time should also have to be managed uh, because time is very important factor in any competitive examination especially in isi b state 2019 20 anything any year it will remain the same so uh, this is very important so i hope you all understood this video but still if you have any kinds of doubts in your minds or if you have any kind of queries uh, which you want to clear then you can call us or you can whatsapp us you have two options either you can call us or you can whatsapp us okay two options uh, 24 7 we are available for you uh, and uh, for uh, making your doubts clear doubt a special doubt session classes are here in our sort of such classes you can call us at the, our number is nine eight three six seven nine three zero seven six at this number you call and uh, uh, make your doubts cleared and you can also visit our website that is www.sorofsirclasses.com you can visit our website and at this website you will get uh, all the information regarding sort of search classes everything you need to know about sources classes is there in this website and for watching this video a lot of thanks from my side thank you students